So I spoke with Carolina, who's from Mexico and is also a Geely owner here in China. And um, she should be waiting. Oh, yeah, there she is, just over there. Hi, Carolina. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. Is this one yours? Yes. How long have you had this car? A few years already. I have been working in automotive 15 years and in autonomous driving five years already. You know, Julie, we love to hear our customer feedback. So I brought you one of our geometry C's to wow. have a look at. But let's start with the look. Do you think it's uh, improved in the appearance? Yeah, I think it looks very sportive, but in the same time as well, very futuristic. How about the headlights? Do you like those? Wow, that looks very nice. 80 LEDs in them and another 200 LEDs at the back. Oh, wow. I hope you like LEDs because we've got loads of them here. <laughs> the level of uh, autonomy has been upgraded quite a lot. So there's lots of sensors at the front. There's actually, there's actually a number of front-facing cameras yes, to help with exactly. the autonomous functions. The radar for the ACC function, adaptive cruise control, is very well hidden, but as well you have a very good radon, so the material is very good to keep not reflections on it. Well, you have ultra shell sensors, great for autonomous parking. Yeah, so it has 540 degree augmented reality camera, so it's like a 360 uh, top down plus a 180, which is like the 3D car. You can basically see everywhere in this yes. car. You've got cameras at the back, like yeah, you said, multiple exactly. cameras at the back. Sensors at the sides, it's a very easy car to drive. So that's very the outside. Well All right, so please uh, take the driver's seat. Let us know uh, what you think cool. about the interior. Super. Something that I notice is that the wheel is smaller as well, more easy to take. And, and here, this part is more user friendly. You're right about the steering wheel. It has been reduced to make this a more suitable car for driving around the city and easier to maneuver. All right, so we've had a look at the interior. I know you're you're really excited to try out the autonomous function, so shall we yes. take it for a drive? That's okay, it. let's go. So Geely obviously have quite a long history here in China and they've used the data they've gathered from like these tens of millions of users they've had in the past to try and make their their cars, including geometries, more and more user friendly. So there's everything, everything kind of makes sense, right? Yes. How many kilometers can I reach? Well, the max range of this edition of the car is 550. The researchers and the developers have made a point of making sure this is accurate. So if you use the air conditioner, uh, driving more aggressively, this will be affected very quickly. So the figure you see should be accurate to within like one or two yes. kilometers. In addition, it actually uses Bosch's most up-to-date iBooster tech, which can regenerate the battery to give wow. it an extra 30% of range. The iBooster e is something that you cannot see from outside, but makes a big difference in the performance of your car. If you look right in front of you, actually, we've actually got a heads-up display, which should give you some of your kind of vital information. I can see the directions of the map as well the velocity where I'm driving now, but as well in the same time, I can keep my eyes on the street. I think we're coming up to a big road up here. This button here by your left thumb, yeah, press that one. Mm -hmm. And then you want to press the, the little, this one here down to set your speed. Okay. And when it recognizes the lanes, the lanes on your picture will turn blue. Yeah, it's they blue, are blue now, yeah. The car will match the speed in front. And if the car in front brakes, then the car will brake too. If it speeds up, it will speed up to the limit you set. Mm -hmm. And including if the car even goes to a complete stop, the car will stop and it's right. starting again. So your car should automatically brake at this red light here. Otherwise, we're gonna hit this bus in the back. Yeah, wow, it's braking, okay. Um... There you go. With room wow. to spare. Wow, that's super cool. This car is also capable of over-the-air updates, so there may be a situation where they can actually increase the autonomy to a higher level using the same hardware. It's so cool that Geely have photo because this is the future and this is the way how the cars will be updated in the future. A good review for the Geometry C? Definitely. Positive? I really like it. I think I uh, have the latest features in the market and I'm looking forward to see which other technologies are coming. I think uh, Geely Futures is bright. 